We're going to start out in the city of Lansing, where overnight police responded to a domestic violence situation that turned into an officer involved shooting. McCoy Scribner is here for you now with the latest on the investigation. Yeah, Nate, I was on the scene just a few hours ago in the 1600 block of Massachusetts Avenue. That's where Lansing police say the incident took place. Now, according to LPD, officers responded to the area for reports of a domestic violence situation where a person was armed and someone was shot. Once police arrived to the scene, they came across an armed suspect, and at, at that point, that's when the officer-involved shooting took place. Officers then secured the suspect and tried giving first aid. The Lansing Fire Department then took the suspect to the hospital where he later died. LPD uh, officials say a handgun was recovered at the scene. They also added that there were no other injuries. The investigation has been turned over to the Michigan State Police per department policy. Now we're also following a heavy police presence situation on the south side of Lansing. There is no official word on what this may be about. This is video from what looks like to be a per perimeter set up by law enforcement around Mary Avenue, Fielding Drive, and Deerfield Avenue. A homeowner in the area tells me Ingham County deputies, Lansing Police, and the Michigan State Police all started showing up around 3 a.m. They could be seen patrolling the area and posted up at every other intersection. Now again, no word on what could be the cause of the second police presence, but we'll be sure to keep you updated on air, online, and through our 6 News app. Back to you. Well, thank you so much for that, McCoy. We're